I would say it's the brain code. Um, we understand a lot about the brain, but we don't really understand how to translate all this activity of nerve cells and pattern and systems into how the communication goes and occurs on a global scale. There's a whole um, dialogue going on between nerve cells. We don't really uh, quite understand what's going on. And we have to understand taking the, uh, what single nerve cells do, what groups of nerve cells do, into what happens to consciousness, what happens to behavior, what happens to desire, thinking, planning, abstract thought. And it's a brain code, and that's a huge mystery. I would have a very similar response. Uh, for me, you know, the big questions are things like consciousness, decision making, what makes us engage in moral <coughs> behavior, how does that actually work? So I think it's uh, something very similar to what Brian has said. I mean, obviously we're interested as well in why do selected groups of nerve cells die off? Why do people get disease? That's what drives a lot of the work we do. But it's some of those bigger philosophical questions that really fascinate. But you know what else is the reason we do this is because it's mysterious. So uh, maybe I'm only speaking for myself, but I don't want to see uh, that sense of mystery lost. This is what drives us. It's because this is what makes us human, and it's the concept that what makes us human could be explained by electrical activity in a group of cells is somewhat magical. 